Hello everybody, Stuart McAdam here, and a couple of you have asked about what some of the recent updates have been on the Facebook platform. So something that caught my attention the other day, uh, both on Hootsuite and also the search engine journal here, has been the release of managing uh, your group more effectively and also having some new buttons and features. So if we scroll down here, you'll be able to see that there are new ways to uh, grow the group, manage it, and, and moderating the content as well. Particularly as your group begins to grow out a lot more, managing a lot of what is being said on the platform becomes significantly harder. So two of the biggest things are the introduction of QR codes, which will immediately allow people to be directed to joining the group, and also invitations via email. That's something that's obviously been missing from Facebook for quite a while. So having that introduced is super cool. Now with moderating the content as well, one of the big things is the suspend function um, because particularly with Meta and Facebook recently, they've come under a lot of criticism for spreading misinformation and being a platform for it. So they're taking some steps and measures for people to manage it. And if you have a look at uh, what has been introduced right here with um, the mention on Hootsuite, their big one is admins will automatically be able to have a suspend feature so that admins and moderators can temporarily prevent members and from participating, posting, commenting, reacting in a group chat. So that's quite an interesting feature that has been brought out and would love to hear what your thoughts are if you are a group admin or if you have a page where you'll find these features helpful in building out your group but also managing it as well. So let us know in the comments section below and we'll see you later. Bye for now.